love you. Get a load of that dame. I think she's weird. Why not? Maybe you've got something that he hasn't got. What? I'd like to tell him, but it's not in the plot. You're strong. You're gentle. He's virile. You're mental. Thank you all. You're a dreamer. He thinks. You're handy. He... Okay, sunshine, I know all about that sort of thing. <laughs> this marriage could make me the happiest of creatures. She must be the character that started double features. Hey, students, what about the jurisprudence? You mean the law? Oh, the law, why, that's a bore. There's a law against sitting on the grass against petting in the park. Laws prohibiting beating wives, thereby inhibiting a million guys' lives. If anything's fun, the laws suppressed it. Tell me what you've done and I'll get you arrested. Laws the Congress passes to me don't matter a bit. They do not apply to Parnassus or the situation to wit. She's in again with that marriage kick. What's the matter? Don't you want to do it? No, but, but you talked us into it. Nevertheless, we state, just to keep the record straight, this can't be legal, it sounds too good. This can't be legal, we're knocking on wood. I remember Uncle Harry when he tried to marry more than one. Where did he went in? I sent postcards to San Quentin. Up here it's love, what's more, it's nice. Bet she keeps a drawer full of old shoes and rice. Let's buy a wedding gown we agree upon. We'll pick it out. I'll put it on. This can't be legal. Get out the Ipso, look up the Macko John. What do you think? This must be that new thing everybody's talking about. You know, this might work out all right if you don't hang around too much. Funny, was thinking the same thing about you. Looking after my interests. That right? a pal, always a pal. <laughs> Pardon me while I get the knife out of my back. But I had to put it someplace, it might get rusty. You get out. Fellas, second chorus. I'll get two kisses from two pairs of lips. Two little mink coats in case one rips. I will have a man for love and a man to fix the oven too. One with endurance, the other with plenty of life insurance. I'll have two mother-in-laws advising me. I'll lace their gloves on, I'll referee. If it doesn't work out, we can leave her flat. Double alimony, what's wrong with that? This can't be legal. It's murder in the first degree. What do you think now? Oh, this is fine. You with the oven and me with the loving. Now, just a minute. How about you with the oven? No, no, you're the man for the oven. Now, don't move. You're perfect as you are. Oh, you move. Now, wait a minute. Let's get back to that oven routine. Oh, you're in. I hear you make a beautiful upside down cake. Love to, but the blood rushes to my head. <laughs> well, never mind then. Just some juice and coffee in the morning. Bring it out. Then what'll you be doing? Oh, just dusting and brushing things off. Fellas, mm -hmm. break it up. You're on. This can't be legitimate. It must be a trap. Let's try a bit of it. Don't be a sap. We can share and share alike in every little thing the three of us do. That's altruistic, but aren't you too optimistic? I'll stand beside you through storm and strife. For your protection, I'd lay down my life. Suppose I'm insulted by a nasty man. I'll run and get him as fast as I can. This can't be legal. Refer to the case of Jones versus Fliegel. At night in my cozy little bed, I'll lie sleeping at the Y. What did she say? At night in my cozy little bed I lie and dream of both of you sleeping at the Y. I want 
want to marry the two of you. Get a load of that thing. I think she's weird. If this is legal, 